So hey everybody, I'm here with Mike from Crunch Cabinets, and uh, a company definitely no more for your amplifiers and cabs, but you happen to make this incredible uh, drive pedal here, so I just wanted you to tell uh, the people on my YouTube and my social media about it. Well, it's actually designed by Brian Witz from Witztronics, but it was made with uh, my specifications and what my ear wanted to hear, and so Brian was kind enough to tailor make this for Crunch Cabinets. It's got a boost and a drive, so it's not a distortion pedal, it's just a drive pedal. And um, when you hit the boost, it's a clean boost and only this knob here will work. Just the top one, I don't know if you can see it from there, but it just says boost. That's all that guy will do. What I did like about this pedal is that it has a presence and a tone. So I felt I could uh, get pretty close to my amp's actual tone when I went to go for drive for like leads or solos without making it get thin or too trebly. I could uh, match my tone and still get a little more, more uh, push on the amp, a little more grit, a little more gain, which helps for sustain and pinch harmonics. So that's what I really liked about this pedal is that it seemed to not get muddy, be very organic sounding. Um, it's almost like having a, a modification on an amp that's just in a box. So what we'll do here is we'll start off on the clean channel so we can kind of walk you through how it works here. when I turned the drive on you got more volume but it didn't get really really distorted so that's the same amount of drive you're gonna get when you have it on your high gain setting um, and that's what I really like because it just gives it just enough to be where you want to be and uh, without being over the top now we can also use the draw uh, the boost function what again uh <laughs> articulate even though when it dries it, it doesn't get muddied up at all right and that's what I like about the boost functions you were able to hear I had it where it boosted up a little bit and it boosted up a lot and I can even put it back where it doesn't boost the volume at all but you can hear it kind of uh, warm up the the tone a little bit there now you can use both buttons at the same time and I found that works really good on a clean channel. It makes a, a, a clean channel amp a little more versatile because now you have like your clean, semi distorted and then uh, pushed even harder with the boost. So let's go ahead and play again. Yeah, we can sure. start off with one. what it does on a clean channel we'll go ahead and put it on the app on the crunch channel here <laughs> Thank you. 
now because the amp's already being pushed on the front end with uh, it being a high gain amp and the 12 8 7s when I hit the boost it doesn't really give the volume much more volume like it would on the clean channel but you can hear it get a little wider and a little fatter um, now what I can do is turn the gain up on on the Pro 2 Plus here and we can also use this to just kind of smoothen it out a little bit, add a little more compression. Like it's not getting like gross. Yeah, it doesn't get flubby at all. It doesn't, uh, like I said, it doesn't seem to change the characteristic of your amp or make it um, obnoxious. <laughs> and like as you were doing earlier, uh, you could get a lot of sustain out of it. So when we're hearing it, if it doesn't sound like it's a big change, that's the whole idea. Right. Because most guys are, are fairly happy with the tone that they're getting. But sometimes they just need a little bit more, just a little, little more, a little more functionality, yeah. a little more, some different options for different styles, that kind of thing. Exactly. Mm -hmm. It might even be just to sustain one note, you know. Yeah. And you put this in there, and uh, just kind of eases things up a little bit, so you're not fighting the amp or, or working too hard with your fingers. Right on, man. That's great. Well, I'll tell you what, man. I'm a believer. I am looking very forward to picking up one of these for myself. Um, and I highly recommend anyone else does too. Um, this is just a mind-blowing product. Again, it's got really nice ballsy gain if you need it really laid back just warm overdrive if you need it but the thing that just kills me again is how articulate it is and how much functionality you have with all these controls with the presence knob and and just all the boost functionality it's just a really versatile pedal and how much are these you're going for right now uh, on the website i believe they're 149 yeah and that's what's free shipping yeah what the hell and we also have it where you can use a, a nine volt battery or the adapter you know, and that's so, like a one spot or something like that. Yeah, right? absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So, Mike, thank you so much for showing me this. Again, I'm looking forward to getting my hands on one. I highly recommend you do too. I'll drop a link in the description with the Crunch Cabinets website where you can find this for sale. And, guys, until next video, I'm Johnny Farrell. Rock on. Thanks, everybody.